here near the Yukon and Jade City, we've got the world's richest deposits of Neperite Jade. And the Chinese won it. <laughs> this is gonna be the million dollar rock. Now, we just have to find it. I will dig till my hands bleed. Go! Jade makes people do crazy things. <laughs> at the Jade Mine Wolverine in northern British Columbia. Nope. A string of bad rocks is starting to get to the crew. Not the one. Nope. Like the furthest thing from Jade. You'll get used to this. Yeah. No good. This one's not paying the bills. Yeah. When it's day after day after day of not finding Jade, everybody on staff starts to feel bad. They know that we're not making any money. It's the most inconsistent thing you could ever mine for. Next, 100% pure grade A garbage. Completely unsellable. Ugh. The Wolverine site have been mined steadily since the 70s. So there's a lot of Jade out there, but a lot of the easy stuff has been gone for 20 years. Jade hunters, including Claudia's father, have been combing through the Cassiar Mountains for decades. Well, if somebody's already mined there before, you don't know what they found, you don't know how much has been taken out of there, and you don't know what's left. This morning, they're cracking open the most promising boulder they've seen in days. It's the big reveal. This could make or break us, unless we find something else quickly. Gravity does go downhill, right? You're standing downhill of a rock. So Justin's nervous that's going to fall towards you, Robin? Yeah. I'm nervous about this one. It could go anywhere. <laughs> oh, good lord! It's too gray. Too okay. many fractures in. If it wasn't fractured, it's still... It's carving. Look if it wasn't so fractured. <sighs> so this means we can't shut her down? No, get back to work. Got to find some more. Get us another big baby to cut. OK, I'm going to go make chocolate cake since there's nothing else I can do other than cry. The dry spell at Wolverine has everyone worried that the area's been mined out. Wolverine is problematic. So yeah, I'm considering moving. The next morning, Robin and his oldest son, Justin, are on the hunt for virgin land. Here's your lunch. Try not to squish it, honey. All sandwiches and just some chocolate granola bars. What? Hang on, hang on. Justin and I are going out to do some prospecting, because he seems to have a good knack on what the jade looks like, and he has the luck on his side. Justin has a bit of a nose for jade. Yeah, it's definitely jade. Justin is a damn jade magnet. Bam. That's what we wanted. Bam, bam. Okay. Today, they're exploring a brand new claim outside Wolverine. If it looks promising, they could mine there next year. You come up for a swim in the hot tub? We'll see first how it goes. In the scrapyard, Jade City handyman Jojo is helping Larry complete a special project for the citizens of Jade City. Yeah, did you bring your towel and your trunk? Oh, uh, no, not really. My swimsuit, it's in the wash right now. <laughs> it's flaming really good in there right now. I want to get as much fuel out of there as possible. A few weeks ago, Larry picked up a load of scrap fuel tanks and decided to convert the biggest one into a giant community hot tub. It's gonna be six feet deep. Larry's ideas are always crazy, but you know what? All of our ideas are crazy. We are a crazy group of people. Today, Larry's taking the tub to its new home in Jade City. Larry, hey! Oh. my best car! <laughs> <laughs>
The fuel tank is still a long way from being a hot tub, but Larry's hoping that with JoJo's help, they can deck it out for this weekend's annual Jade City Barbecue. Done deal. Well, I'm gonna tie her down, take her down to the Jade stores, dump her off, and come home. <laughs> We're out of here like a herd of turtles. Did you want one of these radios, Justin? Yeah, I'll come get it. OK. Robin and Justin are checking out a new claim in an area 20 kilometers outside of Wolverine. I'll take the shotgun, too. We like to go in pairs, and we, one of us would have a 12-gauge in case of any bears that would be in the area. The claim was recently the site of a forest fire. This particular site, it was just a hunch there could be something here because there's jade on the mountains behind it and beside it. You find any yet? No. Well, it's a green stone. Well, still green stone in here. That's that bluish. Yeah. I'm going to walk into the bush right here. Fuck me. Nice serpentine. It's a bummer. The metallic ring is a promising sound, but there's no sign of green. And when the fire went through, it changed the color at the surface of a lot of the rocks. It's like a granite, but it does not look like jade. Okay, it's so confusing. Right. Bear <laughs> Fresh, right there. Justin took off on his own, and he didn't take the gun with him. Justin, do you got a copy? I should have taken the, the gun with him. I didn't know which way he went. So now he's off, but he's without a gun. And we had seen a sign of bear in that area. Cloud's moving in. He's out there somewhere. Justin! Justin! Larry hauls his cut-down fuel tank into Jade City, where he hopes town handyman JoJo can transform it into a hot tub for the annual community barbecue. Hey, JoJo. Hey. Let's get this sucker off. i show you how I unload it. Two seconds unload, huh? <laughs> uh oh. I can't get around. Can you do it? I might be able to just pull ahead with the truck. Okay, yeah. Okay. Now see if we can get rid of this sucker, huh? Okay. Hold oh, no, on, wait, 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 wait. Oh. Holy sh Should I go around and push it in then? No, I'm gonna try and back up, Joe. I don't wanna cut a tire. Okay. Oh, that's close. If I back up, it'll the, the frame of the trailer should catch it yeah. and push it. OK. And then I can swing out a bit, I think. Just wave at me if you see it start to dig into the tire. We'll give it a try. Going to go down that way. OK. Oh, yeah. There's a lot of work to be done on the tub, and JoJo only has a few days before the Jade City barbecue. It's gonna be good, huh? You got her in there for a hot tub party. Well, I don't know if they'll let me in. They won't, might not be worried I might leave an oil slick on the water. <laughs> Justin! 
Robin's son Justin wandered off two hours ago while exploring for a new claim in the backwoods bear country of northern British Columbia. He was there, I wondered if he went around or he went that way. Justin! You can't just start walking because then you end up with two people walking around in the bush. So the best thing to do is you've got to sit and wait. happening you finally come out then it was like okay you know a dickhead no bear hiding here but i could smell something and then they look down and there's bear on that side on that bank i was calling for you because there's two fairly fresh next time you're gonna hike off like that take the damn gun let me show you something here i'm thinking this rock is a big piece that broke off but it's all white powdery i think it got baked no, it and, did. Everything's white. But... And cooked because of the fire. Because of the fire, the rocks here are extremely difficult to read. Let's go home. Yeah, every miner has to check out new sites, because once you've mined out the one you're on, you got to move on. you got to find a new place to be. But if there isn't any big amount of jade here, it's not good. Not good at all. back at Wolverine. Claudia and Robin agree that they should forget prospecting and focus on their existing claim. We gotta use what we have here for now. I'm only terrified for the future because so many lives depend on us making the right decision. We just need, like I told you, we need five good rocks. We have to be great at Five good rocks. And it pays for both seasons out here. Absolutely. That's not much. The four boulders they've found this year could be worth up to $1.75 million, but they'll need at least one more to make a profit after two seasons of mining. We're on our way back to Jade City. For now, Claudia and Robin have to return to Jade City to prepare for this weekend's party. Guy and Justin head out to scour the far reaches of the claim. You suck it up and keep going until you can make things change. Got to find that boulder. We're on a mission for one rock. It's like playing blackjack. A lot of the time, the house is going to win, but that one time, you're going to win big money. So do everything you can to get the job done. I don't think so. If it is, it's definitely low quality. No. No. You were right where you found her. Junk. I'm getting a little depressed there, because put in all that hard work and, you know, don't find anything. Guy and Justin decide to head back to camp. But on his way back, Justin hits a rock. Yeah. I'll take a look. I don't think it is, but. Uh, we may have accidentally came across another boulder, but until we remove more, we won't know. When Justin uncovers the rock, he discovers something strange. Oh, there's a hole. Somebody took the time, who knows when, to drill. I'm not too sure how far they drilled. Somebody's been here before. See how far these guys drilled in here. At the far reaches of the Wolverine claim, Justin and Guy have just uncovered a rock with a drill core removed. Someone was prospecting here for Jade long ago. Two feet, two and a half feet. That would have taken a long time. Not really liking the core hole that's in the middle of it. That's uh, not a very good sign for this property. Who knows who was here 20, 30, 40 years ago? Whoever drilled the rock left it behind. When you run across a boulder that's drilled, it's still there because the drill hole proved it was no good. Or maybe the rock was just too hard to haul out. I don't know. Probably serpentine. You can flip it if you want, but eh. <laughs> I'll flip it. Despite the hole, Guy has a good feeling about this rock. This sand is going to be junk. 
it's not telling us that he's gonna be amazing. Yeah, it's very weird, but I'd bet the farm on this one. Yeah. I think this one's gonna be superb. Okay, let's go get ready for the party. In Jade City, everyone's getting ready for this weekend's barbecue. JoJo's got the biggest job of all, converting an old fuel tank into a hot tub by tomorrow night. I have to go measure, I have to go measure it again. So this one's right here. The first thing he needs are stairs to get in and out of the tub. 46 inches. And that's about almost seven feet. I'm just trying to see if this one is good enough for the platform, for the outside for now. But it's still too low. He'll have to build the stairs from scratch. That for the stairs. It will take time, but hopefully it will be amazing. When he takes a look inside, oh, Jojo notices a bigger problem. If you look at it, if you grab the inside, that's a mixture of oil, diesel, whatever, in like the rust. The tank hasn't been cleaned since Larry torched off the diesel fuel. We have to clean it. I would love to, like, you know, to build this one, like, so nice. This is the thing that worries me. At Wolverine. It's funny that they drilled it and left it. Devin and R2 have just arrived to help Guy and Justin haul out the mysterious boulder. Doesn't suggest that it's very good quality. That or maybe they just couldn't come back and get it. Maybe. The hole in the rock is a bad sign because it's possible that whoever drilled the core thought the boulder was a dud. Just hope it's nice inside. You're going to strap this or like sling this one and then pack it out that way? Yeah. OK. We well, got two straps? Yep. She's getting cradled. Guy is so convinced of the rock's quality that he's worried even a tiny scratch could decrease its value. You go a little lower. I'm thinking I can slip it back. I'm gonna grab that strap right now, bring the strap on this side. What do you think, Keith? Let's go home. A chopper is arriving shortly to take Guy back to Jade City for the annual barbecue, so he only has a few hours to prove his hunch is correct. I think that's OK. That'll work. It's yeah. If previous miners at Wolverine were leaving behind high-quality jade, the claim could be richer than anyone expected. If you get jewelry, great jade, that draws in everybody's attention. Guy prepares to head back to Jade City for the annual barbecue, but not before cracking open a mysterious boulder. There you go. Look at that. Wow. Wow. Very, very good. Can't get much. Better than that. That is very nice. If earlier miners on the claim left Jade this good behind, there could be a lot more. Okay, hey, man. Have fun. Be yeah. safe. Take care. It's enough to prove that we can mine here for another five, eight years. We know there's some on this property. We just keep pushing. He heads back out, hoping the rock will convince Claudia not to give up on Wolverine. Back in Jade City, the annual barbecue is getting underway. We're going to have a party tonight because we just need to have some family time. We need that morale lifting to get through the next six weeks. How are you doing? Good, how are you? <laughs> Guy arrives at the party with a surprise for Claudia. 
I heard uh, you have a present for me. I got a video. A video. And it's the bad end. Wow, that was gorgeous. Yeah. Cha-ching! So, so how good is it compared to the other stuff that we've got? It's so the nicest one. It it's, is, eh? Yeah. There's no fractures in this. It's just a solid, beautiful green piece of jade. We really needed this boost. Somebody back in the day decided this rock wasn't worth the trouble. But with today's red-hot jade market in China, it could fetch several hundred thousand dollars. <sighs> 20, 30, 40 years ago, the jade that was left behind is now a hugely sellable jade. That easy jade is long gone, but lots of jade is left behind in all those jade fields. Good job. True. <laughs> <laughs> what did you get? What's going on? <laughs> it don't look like it's ready. I came to have a swim in the new hot tub and everything. I was a little bit disappointed, but I mean, you can only do so much. I got kicked out of a swimming pool one time for peeing in it. I said, well, come on, everybody pees in it. And they said, from the high diving board? <laughs> <laughs> so, obviously, I ain't going to get wet tonight. <laughs> I even brought my bar of soap, and obviously, I ain't going to be able to use it. <laughs> Nobody's going in the hot tub tonight, but Larry's not giving up on his idea. It's awesome. It's going to come together. I think this is going to be a hit next year. Well, I can put my trunks away then. Oh. Hey, they match your T-shirt. Look at that. Camel. They won't even know I'm in there. <laughs> next time on Jade Fever. Josh, you got to get closer. But I don't know how. Find some Jade. OK. Someone told me that the water smelled in the restaurant. <laughs> can you breathe? No. <laughs> So that means you got a bit in the tank? Yep. Is it empty? It's just, just a typical day in the neighborhood. Smells like the restaurant. <laughs> <laughs>